We also have a crime alert here at five people in the Northwest Valley waking up to find their pickup trucks on cinder blocks. Good evening. I'm Latoya Silman in for Jim Snyder and I'm Marie Mortera. Metro police tells that these have hit at least 16 trucks just in the past two weeks. The tire thefts are taking place in the Northwest Valley around Tanea and Ann. That's where we find News 3's Antonio Castellan. Marie, many of the people living in this northwest community say they are concerned that the tire thieves will strike again. Several plan on parking their trucks inside their garages tonight. Take a look at the Chevy four-wheel drive. There are no tires or wheels. The truck was left on blocks. I uh, came out here uh, Monday morning about 6.30 in the morning and uh, noticed my truck was sitting on the street on blocks. Mike Pratt is one of many northwest residents waking up to the same theft. Pratt lives near Ann and Tanea Way. He tells us on Monday morning he wasn't the only person to find his truck without tires. Several people in his community of Grand Entries found their trucks on blocks. Oh, that's pretty, pretty upset. Pretty surprised that I didn't realize it still happened that people did this. Metro police tell us they are investigating the thefts. Officers say in the past two weeks, at least 16 truck owners have reported their tires and wheels stolen. Pratt says surveillance cameras caught the suspects driving in this truck. Literally, they just rolled up and they took them from the time they parked, stole the wheels and drove off. It was less than five minutes. As you can imagine, the wheel and tire thefts cause damage and are also costly to repair and replace. The wheels and tires being stolen, so they got to account for those costs as well as any other damage that was done to the truck. They're saying it's around $6,000 right now. Police do not have any suspect description. Neighbors say all they know is that four men are a part of this tire stealing operation. Pratt hopes the bad guys are caught before they do it again. Very important because it makes me nervous to keep my truck out here now, even though I want to get it back. It makes me nervous that it might happen again. Police need help solving these tire thefts. If anyone has any information, you are asked to call Crime Stoppers at 702-385-5555. Reporting live, Antonio Castellan, News 3. Antonio, thank you.